I just got off a call. Somebody asked me, how do you keep your leads organized? In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Notion as your sales lead tracker. I actually like to use this pretty much for everything, including my network marketing business, as well as any course creation, eBooks, things like that. I have a template. Make sure that you grab it right below this video, but this is what it looks like. And I'm going to take you pretty much through every tab, but also how you can customize this to yourself. So it comes automatically with a template. Okay. And this is where you can customize it to your liking when you press new let's just say you have a new lead and when you open it right here where it says side peak or however you want to look at it you can look at it here new customer is the template so if you click on that it automatically gives you a little checklist that you go through as well as these two but you can create your own template and that is going to be right here where it says new you're going to go to the new customer which is the template edit it and this is your template. It says you're editing a template. So there you can put anything that you want, any type of checklist, documents, links, things like that. You can put it inside your template. That way, every time you create something new, a new customer, that's going to automatically come up. Now, there are different tabs. So let me give you this example of a lead. Now, you should be tracking who you're talking to, especially if you want somebody to buy your thing. You need to be able to track that. You have the date that you were able to add them. The status, you can rename them, whether they're interested or not. And where did you find this lead? Let's say you have something that's on here that's not in here. You can just create it, type it, and then create a new one with a new tag in it. So that's super simple to do. If you want to add another type of lead location or even anything, even like the status and things like that. The estimated value, this is something that you can use. For me personally, this only makes sense when I'm doing like a coaching program or if I'm doing like a course that I am proposing. For my network marketing, it doesn't really make sense only because I don't know what type of product pack they'll buy. I like to add any social links and if you want more links, email, if you have their phone number, cool. And here's where it gets super cool. So this is where I, when I last contacted test. And then the next contact can be like, okay, I'm going to make sure that I reach out to her on the 22nd. Reminder on the day of. And you can also include different things like time zone and, and things like that. But that's going to be perfect because you're going to get a quick little reminder. The type, which for me, again, because I have multiple things that I offer, that's why I have this. But if you only have one offer right now, that's OK. Here is kind of that checklist that I told you about. And I like it. I think it's important because I'm going to share my I help statement. If you do decide to opt in, I'll have that I help statement attached to this. But this is my I help statement. So I help women achieve X, Y, Z. So let's say I went through this. Cool. And I start a conversation. Well, then I go through in our conversation. I'm going to ask a problem question. What is it that is lacking in your life? I'm not going to ask them that exact thing. But what is it that is lacking? And how can I be of service? I acknowledge like I know what you mean. I felt the same way. But what I found is X, Y, Z. I continue having that conversation. Talk about their goals. And then finally offer my solution. Remind them, well, I do help women achieve X, Y, Z. This may or may not be for you, but my solution, which is my product. So that's why I have this here. I absolutely love it. That's one of the ways that I will continue to stay accountable when it comes to following up with people. So I hope that this helped. There's going to be all the links and everything. It's free. I'm not selling it. I have it for my team, but I'm open to sharing it with you. I hope this helped and I'll see you in the next video.